Hello, Wasteland Operators. It is I, Sean, your Wasteland Operator. <laughs> I finally got my PC up and running. Yay! Everything's pretty much installed and ready to go. We just have one major problem. And this video is going to finish up the PC debacle that I created. Because <laughs> this is all my fault. I take complete ownership. <sighs> After looking at the motherboard of my gaming computer and looking at the i7 that was in the gaming computer, I have come to the firm conclusion that I tightened down the liquid cooler too much. It didn't need to be, it just needed to be snug and I think I cranked it down too much, not paying attention when I, when I installed it. Because when I put the i7 into this computer right here, it would not work. It kept giving me the red light and I did some research and I looked up some stuff and I came across a post, I can't remember exactly where it was, and it said that this one guy said he had two pins that had fused together, they melted together, and they fried his CPU. Luckily, I didn't have an i9 like him. <laughs> but it was an older i9, so this happened a long time ago. So I started thinking, I went back and looked at the motherboard, and I went, oh my God, this is all my fault. I created this issue. I have to take ownership of this. So I leave it up to you to... Um, burn me in the comments below if you must because uh, I deserve it yeah I can't believe I did something like that I normally am really careful when it comes to building PCs and doing stuff like that I mean it was the fourth PC I built I mean that's not a lot but I mean still though you know I, I figured I'd have been better at it but then I ended up because I was in such a rush and I was tired and not paying attention and doing a bunch of other things and trying to get one of the PCs to work I ended up screwing up another motherboard doing the same thing and luckily, I didn't damage the i5. Thank God I didn't damage the i5. But I ordered a new motherboard because I needed a PC. Regardless, I didn't want to stream from just a console. So I got me another motherboard, put the BIOS in it, got the i5 working, tried the i7 again, still doesn't work. So now we're just back to an i5 with a 4060 Ti in it. And I know some people are upset that I sold my 3080, but I needed it to pay a few bills to get me a little bit closer to the Xbox because I had planned on selling the i5 to help me cover the cost of the Xbox and the year subscription for the uh, the uh, Xbox Game Pass Ultimate that I wanted because I still want to play it on PC even if I'm not going to stream on PC because it's only one computer. I'm not doing that to it. If I do do it, I'll be building another PC or buying another PC. But I don't have any plans on doing that anytime soon because my plan is an Xbox and then hopefully by August a PlayStation 5. But I have a bit of a caveat where the PlayStation 5 comes in because of Helldivers 2 and the PSN debacle that they created, even though they've retracted that, I'm not real cool about the way they went about it and how they did it. And I will make another video talking about that after this one uh, because, you know, I just feel like it needs its own video and I still have to write the script out. So with that being said, um, I had, to make, I had to make a decision, so I had been building a, I was building and am still in the process of building a Discord server. I know Connor keeps telling me I need to have a place for people to hang out, so I'm going to create one. And, you know, I, I, I'm not going to, I probably won't be on there very much. And I, I, I'm stuttering. I might be on there a lot. I don't know, but we'll see what happens. And I just, I, you know, if I don't know you in real life, no offense, but I probably won't talk to you on Discord all that much. So don't don't take offense to it because I'm just, I'm an introvert and I don't do well with people that I don't know very well. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't want to offend nobody, so I don't really know what to say. So I don't say anything at all. Eh, I mean, if you met me in real life, I'd probably be like a, uh, I'd be like closed book. I, I just, you know, I don't know what to say to people. I don't know what the right things to say are. So regardless, uh, on to the uh, rest of the video before I continue to ramble on about absolutely nothing important at all. Um, the name of the Discord server was, was and is Wasteland Operators. Because I was like, I wanted something that sounded like Fallout-ish or, you know, Wasteland-ish type deal, you know, of the type of games I play. And I'm like, well, you know, I, I kind of play a lot of first-person shooters. I'm more of an operator in that fashion and I got the idea from operator Drewski I didn't want to steal his name but he's operator Drewski I didn't want to be operator Sean because that had been like you know cheesy so I was just like well you know um how about wasteland operators for my discord server and then when I started having problems with my PC and it died and I didn't know what to do I sent her thinking I'm like I need to come up with a name for my channel because I have to change my channel name 
and people were saying, hey, Sean Games on PC, or could be Sean Games on PlayStation 5, PS5, uh, or Xbox, and I'm like, man, dude, I'd be in the same exact boat that I'm in right now. So if I got an Xbox, I'd be stuck just with Xbox. I couldn't play on, it, it, it would be disingenuous for me <clears throat> to play on Xbox and then go over and play on PlayStation or go back to PC. So this way, being the Wasteland operator, I can play on any damn thing, a handheld, a telephone, or cell phone, yeah. So I can play on pretty much anything that I really want to. So uh, once Human comes out, it's coming out on this right here, and it's coming out on PC. So I can play on both and record on both. It works out. Uh, I can even play on Stream Deck, because I would like to get a Stream Deck one day uh, down the road. But right now, an Xbox is my um, focus. So that being said, um, yeah, that, that's pretty much where all that stands as far as uh, the PlayStation 5 and the Xbox goes and the PC stuff goes and everything. As far as the stream goes, uh, I'm going to one day a week and it's going to be Saturday mornings at 9 a.m. And part of that is because I've started working out. Well, I haven't actually officially started working out again, but I'm going to start. I was going to go today, but I don't think I'm going to go today because I have, I've been up all night and I don't feel like driving 30 minutes there and then driving, working out and then driving 30 minutes back. So I'm just going to go tomorrow morning. It'll be my first day in the gym. But uh, it'll be cool because they got a, they got a jacuzzi. Yeah. So I'll go work out and then I'll jump in the jacuzzi. But I got to have swim trunks. I got to back there. So I got to bag everything up. But yeah, anyway, uh, that's, that's neither here nor there. That's IRL stuff. So I'm going to go to one day a week starting at 9 o'clock on Saturdays. And I figure what I'll do is just we'll start at 9 and I'll stream until I'm tired of streaming which it could be an hour, be two hours, be three hours. We'll do some reactions. We'll talk about some upcoming games. You know, I'll figure some stuff out. And then if it goes really well, I might do two days, which would be like Wednesday. And then I'll give enough span of time for me to come up with stuff to talk about. And then if you guys have anything, what I'll do is I'll open the Discord server and I'll go ahead and start working on it. Now, it probably won't be ready until, say, Thursday or Friday. So don't try to join it right now. Um, <clears throat> cause I'm not, I'm not ready for you to please. <laughs> I'll let you know when, but I do want to have a section on there where you guys can share like, uh, any games you've heard about or any th stuff like that, where you can post on there. And I still got to set all that stuff, roles and all that stuff <clears throat> and bots and everything. Cause now that I got a computer set up, I can, I can work on all that. All right. So, <clears throat> so that's what I'll do. So then we can put that stuff in, in the video. Plus I want to have it where I can, uh, I'd like to be able to show my stream on my discord channel maybe i don't know yet that's hyperbole right now that doesn't matter i'm not even really sure what the true definition of hyperbole means but whatever so anyway the last thing i want to say is this um <laughs> i want to just say thank you to everybody who's been a part of my channel from the very beginning till, till now and anybody who has just joined or anybody you know who has left even if you've left my channel because of the name change or whatever i get it you know uh i understand but the content hasn't changed the content's not going to change the content's going to hopefully get better over time i'm 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 actually kind of inspired it, it kind of reset me in some respects this this whole thing with the pc because i was so focused on the audio that i was just i was so mad about the audio that i just couldn't see past I passed it to be honest with you I couldn't I couldn't get past it and I guess the computer dying actually got me past it I came close to selling the, the and just going to the headset microphone to be honest with you but I'm kind of glad I, I stuck it out and uh, I fought through it and everything and I just want to say thank you to you guys because if it wasn't for you guys there's really no sense in doing this and, and um, I do want to say one thing and I'm going to talk about this in another video that um, you know has to do with putting your eggs in one basket. If you have any desire to do anything like this, uh, if there's one thing I've learned is have something to fall back on. Have another job. Don't plan on ever doing this full time as a career, ever. And the reason why I say that is because I've come to learn after seeing how Twitch treats its creators, how Kick uh, moderators can just I mean, and, and even YouTube, there, a lot of these services are using AI now, and AI is just all over the place when it comes to making decisions on how to ban people. And they don't even have really human moderators doing that anymore too much. And eventually it's going to get more prevalent uh, where AI is more involved 
and a lot of that stuff. And I'll, I'll, I'm talk about this in another video at a later date. But um, the reason why I say that is because don't, if you focus on just doing YouTube, and even if you're multi-streaming like I do, and you get big enough and you're lucky enough to make a, a good bit of money, you, you know, if you don't have something to fall back on and say one day, you know, you do something happens in your stream that can get you banned from every single freaking platform you're on, you're screwed. You know, all that all that time and effort you put into it's gone. I mean, for me, I mean, I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty lucky because I, I used to not have anything to fall back on and now I do. And you know, it came to my my uh, I'm gonna say this and I probably you know, shouldn't talk about it too much but i'm not going to go into great detail but the job i got is very important and uh it came to my attention the other day uh, from my supervisor that there is a possibility i may no longer be able to bring certain things to work that i like to bring to work because of another uh, employee who is taking advantage of that and not doing their job and because this person's not doing their job, it's reflecting badly on everybody else. And it sucks because it's like, that's not my fault. But regardless, if I'm told not to bring certain things to work anymore, I won't. It'll suck and it'll be harder to get to do my job in some respects. But, you know, they're not, it's not a situation to where I really want to take a chance on losing this job because this job is what allows me to do this right here if i didn't have this job i wouldn't be doing this um, i'll probably be just making a video once a week so with that being said that's it i'm done sean is out peace